By the end of this video, you will have experienced the ski trail from Lower Peak to Creek on Whistler Mountain, joining up with the trail leading to the houses on Big Timber Court. Then we'll set off from Big Timber Court with a short walk along Cadenwood Drive to the access trail which will take us to Whistler Creekside and the Creekside Gondola for upload. Now another choice for this location on Ancient Cedars Lane is to drive up to the Cadenwood Gondola Station for download. Parking is available. As I shoot along, please note that Google has not flown over this area since about 1999. So if you're following this on a Google map, it may be confusing. I will be skiing on trails which I know are there, but Google doesn't. My name is Marian Anderson. I specialize in helping people buy ski in ski out real estate in Whistler. And my website, whistlerskiinskiout.com, has a section full of excellent information and videos to help you understand what Cadenwood offers. Link in the bio below. So the first part of the video shows me leaving the lower peak to creek run and shoosing along a trail called Upper Cadenwood. Now directly ahead on the left is, of the screen is Home Run, a black run which arrives at the top of Cadenwood where we are now. Part of the Cadenwood Strata responsibility was to hire a company who would take on the task of grooming the trails twice a week. The Cadenwood owners elected to purchase their own piston bully groomer, which lives in that shed. Now this is where you want to get some steam up because we're going to veer to the right and race past the back of the houses on Trails End Lane. The other trail on the left will take you to the bridge on Cadenwood Drive. From there you could walk home to Big Timber Court, but it's not a short walk and it's not on the flat. I would stick with the route we're taking on this video. I started filming these Cadenwood Ski In Ski Out Trail videos in March of 2020, just as the mountain was being shut down due to COVID. So I only had one shot to film this. Now I expect that once you've done this route several times, you'd be doing less sidestepping at the end. I'm now at Ancient Cedars Lane and will be walking in real time along to the ski trail which will take us from Ancient Cedars Lane down to Cadenwood Drive and Big Timber Court. This walk was very easy and relatively quick and in winter I would expect some snow in the ground that you might be able to use to shoot along to get to the next stop. This section was a lovely trail. It had a very easy gradient. It was a nice width. And frankly, it was a joy to ski down. We passed the children's play park, which is covered in snow on the left. We are now near the entrance to Big Timber Court, which is where the van is parked.
At the start of your day, leaving the more private location of your house on Big Timber Court and walking to the slopes is simple. As you will see, it is a very short walk to the trail, which I am doing in real time. Now it's time to click on your skis or strap on your board and then off you go down to Creekside and the Creekside Gondola for Upload. This trail was very nice to ski. It was wide, it had a nice gradient, and because it only gets morning sun, it was not at all soft by mid-afternoon. This video is one in a series of Cadenwood videos, and each video in the series will show you the ski and ski out access trails throughout Cadenwood. I've now rejoined the lower peak to creek run and now I'm heading in the direction of the creekside gondola for upload. If you're not already working with a Whistler Realtor and you think I can help you, please give me a call. I look forward to hearing from you. Until then, this is Marion Anderson, Sutton Group, West Coast Realty, signing off.